So in today's video, we're going to be talking about the top prospects in the 2021 NBA draft for the Golden State Warriors to select. And if the Minnesota Timberwolves pick this year falls out of the top three, then the Warriors will end up having two lottery picks this draft. So with that being said, if you guys haven't already, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel and also hit that notification bell button not to miss out on more awesome NBA content like this. And now with that all out of the way, let's get into the video. So if the Warriors do not end up trading their picks this year, then that means that they will have to select in the draft. And this year's draft class is very deep. So with their lottery picks, they can actually get some really talented players that can contribute right away. And the Warriors organization said that they want to maximize Stephen Curry's full potential to win more championships. And if they don't trade a pick for an established player in the NBA, they'll likely take a player that is already ready for the NBA from college. But now let's get into prospect number one. So prospect number one for Golden State would be Josh Giddy. So in the Australian League, Josh Giddy averaged 11 points and about 8 rebounds and 8 assists per game. And he also averaged over 1 steal per game. But he will definitely need to improve his shooting if he really wants to become a really good player in the NBA. Since he shot about 28% from 3 point range and also 69% from the free throw line. And he also definitely needs to get better on defense. But his overall game and overall IQ is really high. And if he develops correctly in the NBA, he has potential to become a triple-double threat every night. But for the Warriors, he is only 18 years old and is definitely still a project. But maybe the Warriors view that differently since he did play for a grown man's team in Australia. And he definitely has experience in playing with older men. And there are also similarities to LaMelo Ball's situation last year in Australia. And he's also only 19 years old. But with that being said, do the Golden State Warriors actually need a guy like Josh Giddy on their team? I would definitely say that it would not be a bad option, but again, he's a project type of player. And the problem with the Warriors roster is that they have too many guards already. So I don't think drafting another one is their top priority in the draft, but definitely is someone that has potential in Josh Giddy. But now with that all being said, let's get into prospect number two. So the second prospect for the Golden State Warriors could definitely be Moses Moody. And last college season, Moses Moody averaged about 17 points, 6 rebounds, and about 1 steal and a block per game. And he shot about 36% from 3-point range, 42% from the field, and also 81% from the free throw line. So Moses Moody is 6 foot 6 and 19 years old, so he's definitely a versatile guard. And Moody definitely plays good defense and also is able to shoot the ball very well. And he can also drive into the paint and has a potential of developing into a pretty nice playmaker as well. So he would definitely be a strong selection for the Golden State Warriors at either first round pick. And with that being said, let's get into prospect number three. So the third prospect for the Golden State Warriors would be Davion Mitchell. So Davion Mitchell averaged about 15 points, 3 rebounds and 6 assists last season as well as 2 steals per game. And he is undoubtedly one of the best guard defenders in this draft. And he shot a very efficient 45% from 3 and also 51% from the field. But he definitely needs to improve on his free throws as he averaged about 64% from there. But overall, he definitely has some similarities to Donovan Mitchell, especially in the way his 3-point jumpers look like and his mid-range. And he is definitely one of the older and more developed players in this draft as he is already 22 years old, but he still definitely has upside in his big size as a 6-foot guard. And with that being said, let's get into the final prospects for the Golden State Warriors. And the next prospect that the Warriors could look into selecting in this draft would be Corey Kispert. And Kispert averaged about 19 points, 5 rebounds, 2 assists, and 1 steal per game last season. And he also shot about 45% from downtown and 53% from the field as well as 88% from the free throw line. So he is a very good and elite shooter in this draft. And he is 6 foot 7 and 22 years old so that means that he would definitely bring some good value for the Golden State Warriors either off the bench or starting. And he definitely needs to improve on defense in order to be a very good player in the NBA but I'm sure with an organization like the Golden State Warriors he would definitely improve on that side of the court as well. And he can play either the shooting guard or small forward position. And now with that being said let's get into the final prospect. And the next prospect would be Chris Duarte as he averaged about 17 points, 
5 rebounds, 3 assists, 2 steals and 1 block per game. And the next prospect would be Franz Wagner who averaged about 13.7 rebounds, 3 assists and 1 steal in a block per game. And the final prospect would be Scotty Barnes as he's averaged about 10 points, 4 rebounds, 4 assists and about 2 steals per game. And with that being said, let me know in the comments which player would you guys want the Warriors to draft. And if you guys haven't already, make sure to smash that like button and subscribe to the channel. It was KNYT here and I'm out. Peace.